Hello everyone and welcome to another installment of 10 to Impress, my little YouTube thing where I download games from the Apple Arcade Store and I muck around with them for 10 minutes to see if they impress. It's a quite simple premise or premise as some people would say and today we're going to be taking a look at Game of Thrones Tale of Crows. Let's click play and wait for everything to load up. The time it doesn't start until we have some sort of interaction. Sometimes I'll pause it during an interesting cutscene, sometimes I don't. It's my show and I make up the rules as I go along. Okay, so let's bring up the timer on the screen. I'm going to set my watch going and let's click, let's click the screen now. Can this make up? for what happened during the Game of Thrones finale. Can anything make up for that? Winter has come, friend, and the night promises a storm. Have a drink at my table if you'd sit with a crow. The North offers li little for travellers these days unless you want stories. Stories of dragons and dead men, and a brotherhood all this time. Since the Dawn Age, the Brothers of the Night's Watch have protected the realm, but history forgets them. They fought for us, bled for us, and earned scars and wars that came. Those were my sworn brothers, and it's time those stories were heard. I just... ooh. Okay, right, so you've got to click and hold it, alright. Thousands of years ago, White Walkers came, bringing a night that lasted a generation. But the forest men and the children of the forest joined together and took back the dawn. To prevent the Long Night's return, they raised a wall and founded the Night's Watch to defend it, which was then also knocked out by a dragon. After the Great War, the first men returned to their land, so it was left a Lord Commander to lead our new brotherhood through the dawn. His legend begins at the gates of Castle Black. I'm no narrator, by the way, in case you haven't realised and you're watching this. Well, Devolver, they made a game recently on the PC, and I can't remember what it is. Right, okay, so what are we going to do? A steward approaches. The gates won't open for us. We call out. Brothers of Answer, what is your command? Uh, send, let's set a man who knows our way to look for a hidden way in. Okay, you got to click and hold and wait for it to actually go white. Oh, okay, we can live with that. Hugo has opened the gates. He says there is not a soul in the castle. Uh, what are we going to do? Form a group. Search every hall. Show me the command quarters. The sooner... This will end sooner if I join. Come. Um, let's go for it. Let's go and have a nap. The council sits silent. Oh, we've, we've got war. What's it good for? What's going on? Okay. I'm not... So you can sort of control the map viewing screen here. All right, what are we going to do here? Um, all right, let's go back. Well, uh, no, what's going on? Okay, just ignore that. A steward knocks. The men led their own search through Castle Black. We found siege arms, but they were unmaintained. A faulty trigger left some of the men badly injured. Was there anything else? Okay, so we're so I get what it's doing now. We found only a mass of heavy tracks leading north of the war and a rookery full of hay and hungry ravens. A thousand men were sent to guard Castle Black and now it stands empty. Mount arranging to the north. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. I'm not... I'm, I'm going to be interested if this is going to go down a Necrobarista route where it's more of a... A story with some gameplay elements. All right. All right, what's going on? Come on, let's do something. Oh, I'm just going to click random stuff now. New expedition, what will be its purpose? Maybe we can't do that yet. Few purposes known. All right, let's do that. Okay, 
it's flashing down at the bottom there now, so... Right, okay, we can set that purpose. Oh, we'll choose him. Lu Lu Lucan? Lucian? Okay, give the command. Raven State Time. Primus continues where the game is closed. When a new Raven comes, it waits for you so you miss nothing. Would you like to be informed? Yes, so I'm going to get a notification. Thing. Yeah. I don't mind that because it's Apple Arcade, so it's not going to try and monetize it by saying, Did you know you could speed up your progress by just by buying more coins? Alright, so let's go back to the castle. The steward reports. Abandoned Brothers' name marches north into the frozen west. Alright. We will hold Castle Black. We've got some bouncing dots. With half our number gone, our builders, rangers, and stewards are short handed. Hugo Grank suggests to fight focusing our ranks. Oops, oh no. Maintain our might. Survival comes first, defense is key. Let's survive, let's get some food and look after ourselves first before we do anything else. Oh, a raven returns. A brother tells. Oh, look at that, another problem. We face one more problem, the winch cage refuses to lower to the ground. We have no way to reach the top of the wall. Send two watchers up to climb, okay. Oh, why is my sound gone again? Bear with me. Don't know why it keeps doing that, but my sound just dropped out. Let's pick up the action. A brother tells. The brothers disagree about the horn signals. One blast for allies, two for enemies. We've no need for a third. Okay. Kind of seemed a bit of wasted dialogue, but is that a bit of a plot point? The trail that began at Castle Black leads us deep into the frozen forest. The men hesitate. The trees ahead bear corpses hanging from their branch. Have Lucian go cut them down with his axe as you go. Steal yourselves and tread wary. I like this. You've no time for petty fears. March. That probably didn't do much for morale. I can see an issue coming in HR. Fire up the Karens. Okay. Fearful whispers pass amongst our men. Robert Reed says this stronghold has stood for only a year, yet its walls, are, its walls all have horrors to tell, and I will try reading like James T. Kirk. Um, uh, ours is a young brotherhood. These are merely growing pains. The Night's Watch fights the enemy of all life. Winter will, will be all we know. Let's be a bit positive. At least then when we get dragged into HR, I can say, but I tried to make amends. Let's go back to the map. The ranging party turns rations are, ah, so I'm quite glad we decided to uh, look after our survival stuff. A brother tells. One of our brothers has discovered something else. Oh, really? Uh, the tunnels beneath the council join our horns together. They have a sealed shut with ice. We need those warm walks, oh, warm walks open. Set all make to dig out the eyes. Clear them. Let's go with that. Let's be a bit cautious. No purposes available. Okay. This is this is reminding me of those books that you used to get when you were a kid, where it's like, do you want to open door one, two, or three? And then you'd have to flick to a page in a book. A brother tells. Progress is swift. The brothers carve through the ice with ease, but inch by inch, the ice changes from white to pink. Keep digging. If there's bodies, we can get stuff out of them. We'll salvage them. I'm liking the fact that this. Although you have to wait a little bit, you're not sort of left 
for too long. It's a nice sort of time to breathe and take in the story. Um, algae colours the snow. Let's be ridiculous. Does algae colour snow? That's an interesting one. Not pink, though, I'd imagine. Okay, a brother tells. The deeper we dig, the more our hands stain red. We pick pale yellow fragments lodged into the ice, softened by rot. We aren't sure what they are. We're bark, weirwood bark or bone. Um, let's be a bit bombastic here and just be arse dirt and debris. Nothing more. But you know what? That is it. That's ten minutes. We're done. We uh, And I've got to say... I'm enjoying this. I'm liking the sort of narrative, the storytelling. The music isn't too bad, even though I've been talking over it. Uh, yeah, I think I will give... I'm going to... Yes, this has impressed. It's going to go into my long play pile. And you'll be able to find more videos, and especially when you do the long plays, by doing the old like, share, and subscribe down below. And, of course, a huge, huge thank you to my Patreon supporters. I know I don't have many, but every little bit helps. And if you want to go ahead and make a donation, the link is down below. And I think that will do it. That's the end of this 10 to impress. And until next time, don't forget, like, share, subscribe. And until next time, ta-da!